everyone. I'm not quite sure why I decided to film the intro at the end because now I'm all hot and sweaty. But today I'm gonna to teach you three McMatic style exercises, hips, plies and arms. I must say this isn't my choreography, this is taken from college, but you can adapt the exercises how you choose and how you need to. As this is a pre-recorded video, feel free to rewind if it goes too fast or you need to recap something. In terms of space, it doesn't move a whole lot. It goes forward and back a tiny bit, so just make sure you have enough room to at least put your arms out around you so you're not gonna hit anything. I have done different levels throughout, so if you're struggling, then you can skip ahead, but if not, you can carry on and try the harder exercises. Other than that, have fun. So for the arm exercise, there are two options. There's option one, which is the easier one, which is standard arm, and option two, which is a bit harder, which is standard and new, which I'll explain in a minute. It's two different sets of arms alternating between both. We will add the feet later, but for now we're just gonna do the arms. I'm gonna mirror you, so do the same arm as me as if you're looking at me, not what I'm actually doing. So for example, this will be your right arm and this will be your left arm. So this is standard arm. So you're gonna start with your right arm out and your left arm in. Switch for two, two. Straighten the right arm up, then the left one, three. Switch four, four. Now we're going to bring the left arm down as this one comes out, five, both out for six, wait for seven, and in. So that's standard arm, we'll go through it again. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, hold seven, eight. So that's standard arm. One, two, Three, four, five, six, hold seven, and down. Okay, so that's standard arm. I'll get to the harder bit later. So with standard arm, there's also feet. So the feet is quite easy. All it is is flex and point. I think you can see my feet. And we're gonna go on the flex, we bend, and on the point, we stretch. So, Flex and point, and flex and point, and flex and point. Now, it's not that easy, we've got to do the arm too. So, I'm going to use, so you will use your left foot. Flexing out, arms in the first position. So, one, point, two, then three, and flex, point, four, five, six, and then put your foot on the floor, because it should be slightly off, seven, Bring in eight. So the flexing points are slightly off the floor. And then obviously seven. And then bring in eight. So let's do that again. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So once you've got it to the front, we're now going to take the foot to the side. Slightly off the ground again with the flexing point, still with the arms. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, put the foot down, seven, eight. And then to the other side. So the arm we did before, we're gonna now do with the right leg. One, flex, two, point, three, flex, four, point, five, flex, six, point, seven, put the foot down, bring it in eight. Now, if that was a bit fast, Please feel free to rewind and go through it again. Those of you who have got that, I'm just gonna quickly show you the new arm and then we'll move on to the next section. So the feet are exactly the same. The only difference is that you may do the standard arm to the front, for example, and you might wanna do the new arm to the side or the new arm to the back, but you can mix, mix and match with the order. So the new arm is, we're gonna straighten the right arm, bend the left, one, twist it, two, and then do the first shape again on this side, three, twist it four, switch, five, up for six, out seven, spinning down eight. So the spin goes in, up and out. So that again is one, two, three, four, switch, five, both up, six, out seven, spin down eight. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, spinning down. So that's the new arm. 
So adding on from that, we're going to go front and then side. So all this to the front, all this to the side. And then we're going to go, we're going to tonju the, le the left leg out to the side while bringing the arms up. Make sure it's in parallel, so it's still facing the front, don't turn out. This is one. We're going to bend the right leg and this left leg, so I'm reversing it, it's a bit difficult. Bend the right leg, straighten the left leg, and your left arm will come up. And you're looking up. So that's a one, two, and then your right arm, as you straighten your right leg, will come in and out again. So that's out, up, straighten the leg and come in, and up. And then we're going to bring it in and down. And then we'll do it to the other side. So all of this, so that's to the front, to the side, out, and then bend the left leg, straighten the right leg, arm, up, straighten, up, in, and down. And that's the end of that exercise. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, spin knee down. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, spin knee down. In, and up. And spin and up, bring it in and down. Other side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. In and up and in and out. In, close it down. Little interruption. I cannot get the music to play whilst I'm filming. So I'm going to count instead a bit faster. If I can, I will try and put the music over the top. That might be out of my range, but I'll give it a go. So now I'll go through it all again quickly and then I'll do it at speed and just keep rewinding if you need to. So we've got standard arm to the front, standard arm to the side, the extra bit, standard arm to the front, standard arm to the side, the extra bit and finish. When I mean to the front and side, I mean the feet. So we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, put down seven, eight, to the side. One, two, three, four, five, six, put down seven, eight. In, and up, and spin, and up, bring it in, and down. I forgot to say, on the feet, this can be turned out. This does not have to be parallel. The other side. One, two, three, four, five, six, put down seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, put down seven, eight. In and up, in and up, feet together and down. Okay, I'm going to do standard arm, both sides. If you want to do the new arm and you remember it, then give it a go. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, down. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, down. In, and out, and in, and out, and in, and down. Other side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, Okay, so that was arms. I'm not sure how long that was. I'm hoping it wasn't too long, but I hope it wasn't too short or too quick. I'm very sorry. <laughs> okay, so next we've got hips. Now this is hips, heads and arms all together, but more focused on the hips, so oh, let's yeah. go. Okay, so we start with our feet, shoulder width apart, bend the knees, arms out in second. The first thing we're gonna do is two boxes with the hips. So to the right, to the front, to the left, to the back, to the right, to the front, to the left, to the back. Now on the first box, we bring our arms in. So right, front, left, back. On the second box, we bring our arms up. Right, front, left, back. So that's the first bit. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, 
seven, eight. Then you bring your arms to second and your hips go to the left, to the right, to the front, to the back, to the right, to the left, to the back, to the front. Meanwhile, your head goes in the same direction. So when your hip goes to the left, your head goes to the left. When your hip goes to the right, your head goes to the right. When it goes forward, your head goes down. And when it goes back, your head goes up. That is not on the boxes, that's just on this next section. So that next bit is left, right, front, back, right, left, back, front. So we go left, right, front, back, right, left, back, front. So it's alternating. And the final bit, when you go, so you go left, right, when you go front, you bring your left arm in. When you go back, you bring your right arm in. So it will look like left, right, left arm, right arm, right, left, right arm, back, left arm. So from the beginning of that, we go five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So now I'll do it one more time a little bit quicker. Five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Fab. So when you've got that, there is an extra bit that we're going to add on now. You don't have to do this if it's too difficult because it can be a bit tricky. So we've ended here. Your left foot comes out to the side and your left arm is going to do this. Just circles outwards. At the same time, your right hip is going to bounce back to the side. Like this. And just to make it a little bit more complicated, your right arm is going to do this. In, twist, up, out. In, twist, up, out. Now that all happens at the same time. So it will look like this. And feel free to reverse the whole exercise. So the final exercise is plies. Please make sure that you have space in front of you because we're going to do a few flat backs and pull backs. So you need to make sure you're not going to hit anything. So we start with the four plies and four counts. One, two, three, four. And five is and. Knees go to parallel. Five, but not all the way. And then six, seven, eight. You flatten the flat back. Then we're going to go. Bend the knees, keeping the back straight and up, and then contract, contract, and down. So that first foot goes one, two, three, four, and five, six, seven. Bend the knees, one, two, three, four, contract, five, six, seven, eight. So after that, we're going to drop, drop, one, bring the left arm in, two, three, and then next bit, you're going to pull down like this with an arched back and you're leaning back and to drop again. So it will look like drop, up, 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 down. And then after that, you flatten into a flat back again. And the counts are, and the counts are one, two, three, four, and five, six, seven, and eight. One, two, three, four, and five, six. Seven, eight. One, two, three, four, and five, six, seven, eight. So that's the first bit. Then, carrying on from there, after the flat back, we drop again. We come up, but this time with both arms. Make sure the arms aren't too out or too in. They just occupy your shoulders. Up, and again, release down, and flat back. So from the beginning, that will look like one, two, three, four, and five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, and five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, and five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, and five, six, seven, eight. The last bit, which is the trickiest bit of this exercise, is we're going to do a pullback and back, and then you push up. You've got to make sure that your core is engaged and you don't 
throw yourself back because you end up on the floor. So in front motion it looks like we bend and turn out with the arms and then you slowly push up back into first. So from the top we go one, two, three, four and five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, and five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, and five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Right, now let's recap one more time in first and then in second. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, and five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, and five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, and five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, and five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Point. And ready for second position. One, two, three, four, and five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, and five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, and five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, and five, six, seven, eight. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And that is the end. I hope you enjoyed. If you have any questions, feel free to message me about the exercises or about dance in general. I'm happy to answer. Have fun and stay safe. Then we're going to snap into a flat back and five. Hello, Nala.